is Master Jesus. Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. God, God is, is a good, good God. God. God is awesome God, yeah. And this is Henry. And I am Monique. And she is my wife, That's yeah. my husband. And we have some things to, to share. We got some dreams and also conversations. conversations. Yeah. Um, I don't know how long this video will be, but I just think we need to take our time and do this video and... Uh, yeah, enjoy the moment. Yeah. <laughs> whatever, whatever we're doing, um, and saying the word enjoyment, uh, God is going to bring joy in your life. I know it's a lot of things that's going on um, across the world right now. Yeah, um, especially Texas went through an attack um, with school shooting, and it's a lot of death that's happened, and it's unfortunate to hear the bad news concerning that. Yeah. And uh, I remember um, my husband uh, doing a 2022 prophetic video, and he was saying that, you know, school shootings are going to rise and uh, we need to pray against it. I mean, I, you know, I, I, I just be like, Lord, thank you for showing us. But I think we all need to, and, I, and we are, but we need to more keep standing in prayer. Yeah. And come against the plans of the enemy. God is yeah. showing us for a reason, not for it to happen, but to pray against it. And uh, it's unfortunate. It's really yeah, sad. Yeah, it's, it's so crazy. Satan is so busy, you know, um, attacking the youth, attacking the the, 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 uh, the next generation and all that. But we just need to keep on praying, mm -hmm. you know, keep on praying against these evil activities. Uh, Satan can use anyone, mm -hmm. you know, to just to do some damage. Yes. And it don't matter who Satan uses because Satan don't care who he's going to use. He just use who, whomsoever is available at that moment. Mm -hmm. uh, we just need to keep up, uh, keep uh, the family up in prayers. Mm -hmm. And a lot of, I know a lot of places shooting and killing and all that going mm -hmm. on. Uh, Outside of schools, every day. Yeah, it, it, it is a lot. And because uh, I saw so, somebody posted about uh, a lot of shooting going on in, in, Chica in Chicago. In Chicago, yeah. And uh, you, you know, most of them, you don't hear them. Mm -hmm. You know, we just need to keep on praying. You know, we're already in this world. Um, a lot of times, nothing good comes out for me. But... We need to keep on pushing, you know. We do. And so also the shooting with the guy, he was uh, talking about racism and race. He's what, what, it, what was it? He was trying to save the white race. Yeah, remember that one? Wait, which one is that? Yeah, I don't know it. I don't know the guy's name, but yeah, he got, he was shooting up people. And, oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. I think it was last uh, in, in New York. Was I don't it? know where it happened that. Oh. I try to stay off the news. I don't like hearing yeah. bad news. I think it's, uh, yeah. But before that happened, um, the Lord shared with me that racism is going to rise. Yeah. And see, we have to be careful on um, things like this because, you know, we do have a lot of witchcraft in America. And uh, they can conjure up these spirits. Yeah. And then um, they can use this as a political move. Yeah. Um, they can enhance stories like this and to make a political move. Because um, when I did read on it a little bit, I didn't do too much. Um, they were saying that he is Republican and that he hated Democrats mm. and stuff like that. So we have to be kind of smart on uh, how they're going to perceive it in the news. Yeah. We need to come against shootings and killings regardless. Regardless, yeah. Um, and then also the Lord gave me a dream. Um, and in the dream, uh, the Lord was showing me how racism is going to rise. And, um, but we got to be smart on this too. Because I noticed that when the Lord shows me that racism is going to rise, um, sometimes they will use this as a political move as well and, um, enhance things in the news, um, uh, concerning racism to, uh, deter people's mind. Yeah. Okay. Uh, cause racism is real. 
Yeah. In America, probably in other countries. No, no, it's not going to go away. It's not going to no go away. No what, matter what, how people feel or think. Or, no, it's not going away. Because yeah. if, if this goes away, a lot of things will be exposed and revealed. So mm-hmm. it's not, they're not going to allow it to just go away. Right. But God, I want everybody to know that God do see racism. And uh, the, as the Lord was showing me, these particular people who hates this particular group because of their skin color. God is going to bless the ones who are hated on. So you have to, that's why I, a long time ago, I made a video. It's not good to be jealous or hate anyone yeah. because God will bless the other person. And then you over here looking stupid. Yeah. So, uh, that's how God is going to teach people's, let he going to teach people, you know, since you want to hate them for who they are, how I birth them, I'm going to bless this group of people and blessings are going to happen. And I was so excited to uh, see that dream because it, it's going to teach people a lesson Yeah, and they're going to rise up and get more jealous. They don't want this particular group to, um, um, you know, rise up, yeah. but God is going to allow it to happen. And, uh, I'm going to say particular group because I don't want to, um, talk about race issues like this on this video. Um, but we do know that the, the, uh, African American or the, the African or the brown skin color is the most hated. Um, so yeah, that's what I seen in my dream. And, uh, I was like, wow. Um, so we got to be careful, um, how we, uh, we don't want to get too involved that we are now a part of the hate group. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And we don't want to allow people to brainwash us to think a certain way. We got to be strong. Okay. There are evil people out there. A lot of them. Mm-hmm. And so my husband had a vision concerning Bruce Jenner and they call, well, oh, it was a dream, right? Yeah, it, it was a it was yeah, it was a vision. But everybody call him Caitlyn Jenner as of right now. Everybody know that Caitlyn Jenner is a transgender. A dude. <laughs> you so silly. <laughs> yeah, so uh what I saw is not good. It's not good on the he better repent as soon as possible. He better repent as soon as possible. And this will be the last warning. God is warning him that something is about to befall the family that will make people to cry. God is calling for his attention, for for this warning, for repentance. If you will get this video to him and his family uh, as soon as possible. Lord, Lord, Lord. So let's keep uh, Bruce Jenner up in prayers. Uh, I pray that he repent. Yeah. Okay. So my husband had a dream yeah. about Joe Biden. So in this dream, I saw Joe Biden. I saw a lot of uh, uh, people in Congress or people in this power. So a lot of them, maybe three of them standing out there, one or expose the truth concerning what has been going on with joe biden what has been going on but the way he was looking at them is not your time don't do this please you know like trying to make sure that they all are in the same tune and those people couldn't even say anything no more because it was a lot of people out there but these three people standing that really into want to say something so that the public will hear you know he was controlling them with uh you know like it's not a time don't do it now you know stuff like that and uh, i woke up from that dream i was like wow so all those people that are really pushing him holding him up they know what they are really doing they know the truth and this whole thing has been Really, it's like, it's like destroying a nation 
with uh, 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 evil agenda, evil mindset, and uh, they are in agreement with all this. Mm -hmm. So we are going to pray that God expose this. I know God has been exposing a lot, but because media are not covering a lot of them, right. and they are ignoring a lot of things too, mm -hmm. but we need to keep on standing. Let God's will be done. Let God, at the appointed time, let him show himself. And also you was telling me after your dream that um, the people who are acting like they're against Biden is just being fake. Yeah. They are actually for him. They just acting like. Yeah. They're act. Okay. So basically, um, they're acting like they're against Biden and they acting like they want him arrested. But behind the scenes, they all work together. They all work together. So, yep. It's it's crazy. Yep. yep. So I want to end this video off with a good note. Listen, I want everybody to decree and declare up on your life. Um, put God first in everything that you do. Give yeah. your life to Christ Jesus um, because he loves you. And he, he, you're still living. He has patience for you. And, uh, I believe that whatever you ask in Jesus' name, he will give sure, it to yeah. you. This is a year of, uh, well, I'm not going to say the year. I'm going to say the season of blessings and favor. Yeah. Um, I also had a dream where I was in church and the person said, God is about to bless everyone mm. um, in this church. So it was like the body of Christ is about to be blessed. And uh, in the dream, I began to tell everybody, hey, Lift up your hands and begin to worship him Amen. before it happens. Amen. So everybody start waving their hands and worshiping the Lord. Um, so uh, it might be a lot of things going on around us. And there might be a lot of bad news going on around us. But always remember that God is going to cover you with the blood of Jesus. Amen. He's going to protect you. And he's also going to restore your home. He's going to restore. Um, he's going to bring blessings upon your life. He's going to open doors that no man can shut. Um, so it's good news coming. Um, and I just thank the Lord for that. Yeah. So do not be discouraged. God has not forgot about you. And even all this monkey pops and COVID-19 stuff that's being out there in the news God will cover you with the blood. We're yeah. keeping you up in prayer. And uh, always remember that we pray on every Wednesday. Just subscribe if you can so you can see the notification. Um, because sometimes we pray at 7, sometimes we pray at 8 p.m. Central yeah. time. Yeah. yeah, because of my walk time. Yes, yeah. So things can change on that. But just just keep remembering that God loves you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. He will not allow his children to beg, to beg for, bread. for bread. Listen, if you haven't subscribed to Henry and Monique, go ahead and do so. You know why? Because it will automatically make, make you a cool Christian. Christian. Because cool Christians. We're in God over here. here. God bless you all. We love you guys. Bye, y'all. Bye.